Hi, I'm Lyle Luzum, and I'm the chair of the Winnishing Energy District. As we celebrate this 10th year, we'd like to help make you aware that there are some tax benefits this year that may or may not have been available in the past. This year, because of the pandemic, the CARES Act provided for the addition of a special deduction for charitable contributions for anybody. If you do not itemize on the federal return and use a standard deduction, and you have given up to $300 for any charitable contribution in cash, you can take $300 as a deduction off of your income. So that will reduce your income by that amount. And that, of course, will reduce your taxes. This is for anybody who has given charitable contributions. If you do itemize on the federal return this year and in 2020, cash contributions to charitable organizations can be fully deducted up to 100% of your adjusted, adjusted gross income, rather than the 60% cap in the previous years. Finally, a long-standing uh, rule is that uh, if you are 70 and a half or over and have an IRA, you must take required minimum distributions from that IRA. One way that you can save taxes is to have the distribution from the IRA go directly to a charitable organization. This is known as the Qualified Charitable Distribution or QCD. You should arrange with your IRA distributor to make arrangements for sending that to the charitable organization of your choice. And what can, what can happen then is that those distributions no longer count as income to you and they reduce your taxes. 